I'm so sick of you, Meg. Listen, I'm just sick of the lies, Meg. Listen, Meg, listen. You is obviously lying. You obviously lying. Listen, let me tell y'all something. Let me tell y'all something. I watched the Gail King interview, right? Bro, Meg the Stallion lied in the first two minutes. First, she said that, uh, she wasn't ready to go. The argument started because she wasn't ready to go and everybody was ready to go, right? Two seconds after that, she said that she had been at the party all day and she was ready to go. That's a damn lie. Listen, I'm not an attorney, I'm not a, I'm not no uh, lawyer, police, none of that stuff. But I'm just saying, Meg, all your interviews, you contradicting yourself. Why would, why would your story not be the same each time if it was the truth? The reason why your story is not the same is because you are lying, Meg. Let me tell you something, Meg. The internet is undefeated. Boy, let me tell you something. The people on the internet, they saw murders, cold cases, crimes before the police even saw them and we feel like you lying man we feel like you lying let me tell you something the story is that girl was mad because you had to have sex with tori and you knew that she was having sex with tori and you went behind that girl back your friend and you hunched that girl people who she was hunching that's what the argument was about you and Tori went in that car to have relations. That girl came out, caught y'all in the car, and that's when the argument ensued. You feel me? That's what it was about. That's why you didn't tell what, a, 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 what happened a, a, uh, initially, because you was trying to cover up the fact that you was out here thotting. You feel what I'm saying? But it came out anyway, man. Me personally, I don't know who shot you. I wasn't there, but I don't believe Tori shot you. I believe your friend shot you. I believe Tori probably tried to grab that gun from that girl. And I believe that girl finna shoot the shit out you for hunching the man that she was hunching. Tori, when he, I saw Tori uh, live statement about what he was saying, he was trying not to tell on the girl, but at the same time, protect himself. That's what he was doing, man. I could tell how he was talking. Man. You initially didn't even first say that Tori shot you. You said that on your live that night, which was Tori's birthday. You feel what I'm saying? Let me tell y'all something, man. Money do not change people, bro. It, it, just, it, just, it, just, it just magnifies who you already was. And I can tell Meg is just a regular chick from the hood who attains some celebrity, but she still got them same characteristics, them same toxic traits you out here sleeping with somebody that your friend slept slept with you a celebrity it's multiple it's many people that you can sleep with other than the man that that girl sleeping with that's foul as hell that's foul as hell that's the type of shit you do though and i'm pretty sure everybody in the industry know what's really going on i'm pretty sure there's more dudes in the industry that's done hit you mad i ain't got no problem with you being promiscuous me personally i ain't judging you on that but what I am mad about is that you're trying to bring down a black man because and co to cover up some stuff that you're embarrassed about. Grow up. Grow up. If you hunched that girl, man, which we all know you did. If you want that girl, uh, people just say you did. Or don't be lying to try to get this man in jail. If this man can convict, this man get deported. He can never come back to the United States for the rest of his life. Like, don't listen. It's a lot of women out there that try to destroy a black man once the relationship is over, bro. Or men, period. Y'all got to stop those type of women. Not all, all women. But those type of women need to stop doing that. Y'all have past trauma from previous relationships or situations or stuff that you grew up in. Maybe you had no dad in your life. Or maybe somebody molested you or something like that. Deal. You got past trauma. You need therapy, man. Because I know that inside this comes from something else and you carrying on the charade but the problem is people gonna cancel you if if this if this thing come out that tory didn't shoot you man the one thing that and, and yo you have a lot of women fans that's riding for you man but one thing women don't like 
is when, when other women try to destroy good men, especially good black men, Meg. Man, I told you before in my video, I don't know if you've seen it, abort, Meg, abort. You need somebody to tell you that this is not the proper course of action, Meg. For real. Like, for real, you letting a lot of young girls down. You letting, you, excuse me, y'all, I'm, I'm swearing like a mother. Y'all letting, you letting a lot of, you letting a lot of young girls down who look up to you. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you tripping, bro. You tripping, dog. But this is, but, but this is a classic case of how sometimes women try to destroy men because they hurt. Hurt people hurt people, man. For real. We're going to go live. We're going to talk about this a little later on, too. Like, share, subscribe, comment, chill.